So I'm currently downstairs and I have started the process with my office. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the trim and the crown molding and all that and all that jazz. The problem is I was supposed to be cleaning today and then I got a phone call so I'm like, babe, we gotta go, we gotta go drive. So we just drove about an hour out to go pick up some chairs from my office. Now when I tell you God is good, God is good. So right here, I'm gonna put a chair. I was looking at that particular chair on, um, on Overstock. I wanna say it was about 357 for the chairs. But then my client called me and gave me a little gem and I was like, oh my gosh, you guys, you about to see the new chairs. So here goes my new chair, you guys. This one has the cover on it. I'm not gonna take it off until it's time for it to go into my office, but look at the chair, you guys. This is the Bernhardt Swivel. Swivel, you guys. This morning, we drove to go get the chairs. Like, did I say that? I think I already said that. Anyway, so I, I, okay, I think Craigslist is a really great place to find things. My only issue with it is I'm a girl, I'm five feet, I weigh probably like a buck 30. I'm not fighting nobody, okay? Number one, and secondly, it's probably a really great way to entice me to kidnap me to tell me that you got some good quality furniture in the truck of your car and come get it. <laughs> oh, we have these Bernhardt Swivel chairs that you've been looking at on the internet on Overstock, and we're going to be selling it to you for a great, reasonable price. Listen, I'd have been gone, y'all. It would have been the last you've heard of South by Casanova. But, you guys, Babe loves it. She bought them for me for my office. I am not gonna finish cleaning my closet because babe is gonna help me situate the office. But the chairs, I hope you guys like Did I show you guys a good view? I'm gonna have babe hold the camera and I'm gonna turn it around that way you guys can get a really, really great view of the chairs, but they are gorgeous. Listen, let me just tell y'all what she said. Let me, let me, let me tell y'all what she said. She said, I had a lot of offers and a lot of people reached out to me and I said no. So I'm like, why did you say yes to me? And you said it was just something. She said, I went on your Facebook page, looked you up, seeing you wasn't a killer. So I was like, I was like, I looked you up too, boy. I meant to make sure you was gonna kidnap the girl. Cause you know, I ain't wanna be dead yo, over no Bernhardt. <laughs> so I'm, I'm too excited. I'm too excited to clean up right now. I'm too excited, but I'm gonna clean the office. I ain't gonna clean that space. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the crown molding and stuff and the video is gonna end. But let me show you the chairs. Let me show you my swivels. Oh my gosh, God is so good. Mm -hmm. Baby, hold this. You got it? Sure. You gotta hold it like at an angle, like that. Yes, baby. Here's the chairs. Here's the chairs. Hey. Babe, pan it down a little bit. Oh yes. You like Too much. He holding the camera for me, y'all. This first. Y'all gave me to 200, so maybe you should follow me around the house as I clean. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, babe, you should follow me around when I'm cleaning the house. Like, I see it all the time on YouTube. Like, come on, hold the camera, let me clean, you know? Right. Come on. Don't you want to do that? Mm -mm. Come hold the camera. I can't afford to pay you your salary, so you can't never hold the camera. You're trying to work on your salary. We are working on it. It's looking, it's looking okay. It's looking okay. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> exactly. It's looking what? It's looking okay. It's okay. <laughs> it ain't happening. It's okay. It's okay. Anyway, you guys, <laughs> pan. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me put my skirt down. Hold on. Pan down. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my lovely chair. I didn't talk too much to y'all today. Y'all have a good one. I can't keep recording when I'm on this this high. This is called, uh, what is it like, finding myself high? What is this? I got an office high. Bae's holding my camera high. Woo! Anyway, you guys, it was a pleasure hanging out with you. It was a pleasure. That's my client's bag. I'm gonna, I have a video coming up at Haverty's. I purchased some stuff for her and I have to go down. So, um, you guys have a good one. I hope you enjoy seeing my, my uh, chair. The crazy thing about it is, 
I haven't done consignment in so long just because I was just like wanting the house to get done. I got tired of waiting trying to find what I actually wanted. And I think I'm going to go back to doing some consignment because this was a great find. So thank you, boo. I ain't going to say your name because you may not want nobody to know who you are. I just want to say thank you so very much. These were great. I'm going to go clean my office with babe. She's offering to clean. We got to go clean. Bye, y'all. It was good talking to y'all. I don't feel good. Come on, come on, YouTube husband. Come on, follow me. <laughs> come on, come on. Come on, let's just come. I don't want to. Babe, come on, you gotta be like them other YouTubers so I can make, get I them don't. views. Mm -hmm. come, follow me, just, you're gonna get up anyway. Come on, I'll hold your, I'll hold your Gatorade. <laughs> I don't come. feel good, I wanna go. Follow me. No. Follow me. <laughs> <laughs> come on. Let go, come on. I done made it to 100K, now I, I gotta be a real YouTuber now. Follow me. <laughs> Real, 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 real YouTubers. They did makeup and hair. You looking the No, real YouTubers. Uh, uh. They have their husband follow them around with the camera. Come on, come on. Uh huh. Come on. You gotta follow me. I don't want to though. Just hold it. Okay, you guys. So we're gonna go to the office. Follow me. <laughs> Pan down like Noah that. Noah is here today. Okay. He's gonna put in the crown molding, which I'm so excited about. Um, this is it right now. There's nothing there. I don't want to go down. I don't want you guys to see all this stuff that's all over the place, but I'm so excited. So, so excited. But he's going to do the crown molding today. And then, um, I'm going to paint in here. I don't think I'm going to leave it white. And then I'm going to change the light fixture. So, like always, you guys are going to get to see the beginning and the end so at the end of the video i'll show you what it looks like all right all right you guys so with all the excitement about my new chairs for the office i had to find a way to burn off some of that energy so i went on ahead and i'm cleaning the master bedroom now i'm not going to be doing too much in this space just making it as i did before because i do have a partnership coming up with overstock where I did pick out some new pillows and a couple of more items for the room and that will be coming out in about a week or two so for right now I'm just going to go ahead and make the bed as is if you guys are looking for where I purchased most of the items I did have a massive bedroom tour that went up about a month ago and I will be leaving a card that way you guys can click and watch that in case you missed it So now I'm going to be moving on to the front area of the bed and I'm starting off with the throw. This throw is from Home Goods. It is bigger than your standard 50 by 70. I want to say it's like a twin size, but I absolutely love it. It just looks so nice draping over the bed. The pillows are from Overstock. They're still available. I did look them up before doing my voiceover. The bench, which is actually a day bed, is still available and I did haul this um, a while back and it is from Overstock. Now I'm going to go ahead and move on to the laundry, you guys. If you don't know, my laundry room is actually downstairs, which I hate. I wish it was upstairs just because the constant up and down, I'm just like over laundry. But um, I'm putting up my clothes and also babe's clothes, so I kind of separate them. The things that need to be folded in the master goes in there. And then I have a few items that go into my closet. And then the ones that need to be hung up, I hang them up. If I'm going to be like 100% honest, the only clothes that I take out the wash and put up right away is probably the kids' clothes because they need them for school. But when it comes to me and babe stuff, I'm just kind of like, okay, I'll get to it when I get to it. So today I'm getting to it.
So now that I'm done with the clothes, I'm going to go ahead and just do a really quick wipe down. Now the master bedroom stays pretty clean. I know it may not look dirty, but I still have to do my routine dusting and vacuuming and just kind of keeping things up in the space. So I am going to be using my Dyson canister for this, you guys. I still love my vacuum so very much, but I am looking to purchase another one. I'm kind of over the whole like lugging the vacuum cleaner upstairs and downstairs. So I think I'm going to look for like a cordless one now for me to pick up. But in the midst of me vacuuming, I realized that I had removed the towel from behind the mirror and I never put it back. Now this is just a small tip. You may find it helpful or not. But I noticed when I have something really heavy laying against the wall, there's always a mark when I move it. So I find that putting like a towel or even one of those like cotton balls behind each corner of it removes the mark from the wall or doesn't it prevents the mark from getting onto the wall. So if you're like me and you just like your walls to be nice and clean, you might find this helpful. But I'm going to go ahead and move on to finish vacuuming. If you guys are interested, the rug is from Overstock. I normally get my rugs from Overstock or um rugs usa but recently overstock has been like my go-to place just because i am finding the things that i want and the quality is still there and the price is just really really great the rug is a 9 by 12 and again i will be linking my bedroom tour that way if you guys are interested you can also click on that so now i'm currently in our sitting area which i love Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start cleaning off the coffee table. I kept everything really simple in this space. But since I'm so close to being done cleaning, I'm gonna go ahead and light my candle and just have a really great smell going around. I gave you my tip that I got from Miss Nina Renee 24. If you guys aren't following her, follow her. So she told me about removing the um, removing the label off the candle just to give it a really nice clean look. So now I'm moving on to the fireplace. And again, I really do love this fireplace so very much. I'm spraying just a little bit of spray weight on there so that way I can get the dust on there. The spray weight is really light. It's not harsh. It's not going to damage it. I've been using it for a while. It leaves no watermarks on there. I don't know if you have anything that's a wood veneer that you're looking to clean. You can clean it with a damp rag. You do not have to use a sprayway cleaner. Now I'm moving on to mopping you guys. And I'm so excited because Babe was like, you want me to hold the camera? I'll hold the camera. So she was holding the camera for me, you guys. But I, I tell you right now. Do not expect this to happen anymore because she's showing you all of my cellulite. I don't know what kind of cameraman she's trying to be today, but it's not so good. <laughs> I'll stick to my tripod for now, but that's pretty much it. I'm going to go ahead and mop the entire space. And she's, you know, I'm going to give her an A for effort. You know what I'm saying? This is her first time, and I'm not going to complain too much because at least she attempted, attempted to be my YouTube beau. So I'm going to give her a little bit of credit, but it's definitely not to be expected again. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and finish mopping up the room. You won't believe we've had our way, but somewhere there's a light inside of us. It shows the way. Not looking for no, no, no. All right, you guys, my room is all clean. Thanks to Babe for holding my camera. I hope you guys appreciated that. Not gonna happen again, probably. <laughs> but everything is nice and clean. I have the vacuum. I gotta go finish cleaning and stuff like that. But before I go, I just want to show you guys one more thing. I have a collab coming up with Overstock. And I did get these beautiful mirrors. I think this is probably going to be all the gold that's coming into this room. Because now I feel like it's a little oversaturated with gold. But I do love these mirrors. They are from Uttermost. My plan is to pick them up just a bit. And have them like right over just to add a little bit more light. Not like this room needs it. But I have two. Okay, so here's this one here. Which is going to go up on that wall. And then here's the other one. And I love it. Yes, baby. Um, I do have a video coming up because I'm going to change all of the hinges and the doors here and I'm going to get the doors repainted. As you can see, just by touching them over the past three years, they are a bit dirty and um, 
I don't think they really gave the, the doors a really good coat of paint when we first moved in. So I've been doing the Sean Williams um, polyurethane um, trim enamel on there and that has been great. It's been making the cleanup so easy. So I'm gonna have the guy come out to help me situate it so I'm not stuck all day painting. So I'm excited about that. So I think that's about it, you guys. You guys. OMG, it looks so good. Oh my gosh. Incredible. Look at my beautiful ceilings, you guys. Oh, I love it. Oh, it just looks so good.